What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today we'll learn how to play Make It Right by BTS and Love. So it's going a bit straightforward guys. Uh, I don't like BTS. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, I just heard one song uh, by an accident. Accidentally I just opened one from a BTS. I saw them and just like I don't want to go with BTS. So that was over guys. It's my feeling. I actually don't like BTS and I'm just going a bit straightforward. Don't feel bad if you like BTS. But this song I will be covering completely because I love love songs and they're great. So let's get started without a capo. Stand tuning out three sections. So one is a chord strumming, another is this one melody, and another is bass riff. So uh, we need four chords. Uh, we can actually have main two or three chords added more, but this one will make it super easy for you guys. So just four chords. G major, three two zero zero three three. Then we have C major, three two zero one zero, mute, mute three two zero. Uh, I think guys getting a bit darker, so I need to switch on the lights. Just a second, guys. Nothing's clear. So C major, mute three two zero one zero. Then we got D major, mute mute zero two three two. Then we got E minor, uh, zero two two zero zero zero. These are four chords. Uh, now this, I want to show you this part first. Then the chord swing and then the bass. So what they're actually doing is they're uh, playing the tenth fret on the high E string, which is our D note. Second fret, sorry, ten fret, guys. Ten fret on the high E string. Then play the twelfth fret on the B string. Then we'll play the ten fret on the B string and go back to eight fret on the B, B string. So you got. The reason I'm doing a vibrato over here is because uh, there's a rest. And you can just kind of play like this. Well, not play like this. It's like. So just to get a special thing, I'm just using that. Never mind. So we'll play this three times, then we'll get on the next part. So next part is it's nothing same. Ten fret on high E string, twelve fret on the B string. We'll just go to seven fret of the B string, then come back to eight fret on. Sorry, uh, yeah, eight fret on the B string. So we got. I'm playing it again. Once more. Then that part. Full speed. This was the melody. Uh, now let's show all the costume you know. So what we're doing is we are playing G major chord, then C major, then D major, then E minor. So you're playing down, down, up, up, down, two times on each chord. So down, down, up, up, down, 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 up. Down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down. Once on each chord. I sorry, I wrote two times, but it's once. <coughs> so one, two, three, four, G major. Down, down, up, up, down. Uh, between this, you can actually add some. Uh, Use strong strokes like this. So you got G major, down, down, up, up, down. Go to C major, again play down, down, up, up, down. Again on the C major play down, down, up, up. And the down stroke will be on the D major. Just changing from D uh, like from C major to E minor, we got D major in the middle. So just play D major once and go D minor, then down, down, up, up, down. It's kind of very easy. Take it easy. So let's get started. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. C major. Down, down, down. Down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down. One, two, three. Okay. 
bien. Now let's jump into the bass riff. <coughs> so it's So what we're doing is we are playing fifth fret on the A string. Fifth fret on the A string, then seventh fret on the E string. Sorry, on the A string. Fifth fret on the A string, seventh fret on the A string, like this. So da da. Rest two, three, four, da da. So five, seven on the A string. Then four five on the D string. Then seven eight on the low E string. Play twice. Then play five five on the E string. Now just see guys what I'm doing. Five seven on the E string. Now four five on the D string, yeah. Two, three, four. Now we're on the E string. Seven, eight. Then five five on the E string. Then I can go back to that part. And that's everything for Make It Right. I hope you enjoyed uh, learning something new today. And let me know down in the comment below any previous song you just want to learn on guitar because I don't like previous. But if it's your request, and I'm ready to do any song. So see you in my next video. Bye.